pretty nice silver hin, this one. That's an awesome fish. There we go. That's skinny. That'd be about four pound fish. Don't go over the rock. So there we go, that's a start. Um, just came into this bit of water here. I was actually, I'm actually planning on moving down a lot further, but I thought I'd have a little bit of a cast in this bit of water here because it looks pretty nice. Got that one out of there. And I think it's now time to uh, move on down. Uh, fairly late, in, well, not too late in the day, probably around just after midday. So hopefully, just so that I'll pull a few out and depending on how it goes, we might make a two part video, we'll see. But hopefully we'll go catch some fish and we'll see what we can do. So I've just found this bit of water here. I've never fished this bit of water before, so it should be interesting. Uh, it's pretty, it's not too deep, it's just quite fast and ripply. So it'll be interesting to see what we can pull out of here. I won't fish it with a very long leader, a little bit of weight, get down to them, and hopefully they'll take what we put in front. see a fish out there, he's definitely feeding. He's taking up the surface and fortunately I don't have any dry flies on. Ah! Had him. Fucking finally! This guy better stay on. Strip, 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 strip. Really hope that this guy's worth the wait. And we get him in. First things first. And I hope he's on the Polish pheasant tail. He's not. He's on the here in copper. Nice fish though, shit. If I was hungry. Fat fish. Check her out. Finally, fish on the board. Second fish on the board, but it's been slow, hard work. There we go, two fish real, real close together. Come on, I can't deal with any lost, more lost fish today. It's on the bloody dropper again. There we go, pretty small spent hen. Off she goes. Back into it. I reckon this is going to be a pretty good spot in the summer. Fucking hell. Just going fish after fish now. Fuck, this guy feels lively. Shit. He's either wrapped or fouled. Real dark jack. Maybe not wrapped. Maybe was wrapped. I think I've figured out their spot here now. That was literally first cast after that, after the other fish. And I changed fly as well based on the fact they were taking that dropper fly. You're not going down there, mate. Like, fuck. Oh. For what looked like a pretty spent looking jack, he had a bit of fight. And I don't actually think he was wrapped or fouled because I 
I think he started out that way. But then I saw him again. It, I was pretty sure I could see it in his mouth. There we go again. It's out in that faster water there. It's a beautiful fish. It's been a bit like buses today. We wait for fucking ages and ten come at once. This looks like an absolute pig of a rainbow from what I've seen. Yeah, it's too bloody. This is going to be a solid fight that is fresh as that was silver gotta land him gotta land him gotta land him walking down with him like this is a bit of a gamble getting closer and closer to those rapids but i gotta get him in this slow slack of water here he's got him in there got him in there There we go. Fucking awesome fish. Happy with that one. So there we are, done with this spot. I'm gonna move on and I think I'll go somewhere else as a part of this video. And that's where we're going to be now. Cheers. I just crossed just down there. Always try to cross at the widest part. Not always the widest part, but try to read the water, make sure you stay safe. And I'm just going to have a cast in here because I've been wanting to fish this water for ages. So, a bit of commotion going on here. I can actually see a few fish scattering over this way because of this. It's not even long after those rafters were here, so just goes to show don't fret too much when a raft comes through. I can still see them down there. Ah! Oh. Fuck! I had him right in close. He actually took the glow bomb. So I thought after that fish got off, it was a pretty appropriate time to make a change. I just went a little bit longer again and also changed my point fly. Just after the pool, it had a bit of a stir up of that fish and the rafters and everything. It's a good time to make a change. Give the pool a bit of a break at the same time. There we go. Ooh. Come on. Don't want to lose two in a row. Again, it's on the glow on, so they're really going for egg-like patterns today. Despite the summery conditions we've had lately there we go god that's a pretty ugly fish there we go so a pretty slabby spent hen and already had a fly in its mouth 
had already been caught on what kind of looks like a not really sure it's like a bit of a soft heckle so I guess finding that fly is a good reminder to for me as well to use barbless hooks when you can I usually the majority of the my flies I use are barbless but I'd be lying if you say you wouldn't catch me the odd time being lazy and not cramping the barb down on one so probably a large part of the reason behind that fish's condition be having a fly in its mouth I'm sure eating and all those kinds of things would be a little bit harder Gotcha. Hopefully you were able to see the indicator action there because that was just like a indicator didn't go under it just did a little twitch. Very suspicious little twitch. And it's real sandy bottom your eyes it's a good idea to at least set that hook and never know what it could be. Come on and finally we catch a fish that's not on the glow bomb. I was starting to feel a little bit offended that they weren't liking the look of my Polish pheasant tail. There we go. That's a nice as fish. Beautiful fish. Uh, that was surprising, I didn't even think that that was a strike. I more just lifted my rod than set the hook. I think we might call this a day after this fish, whether we land it or not. Uh, oh, what is... Why didn't my fucking line give? So there we go, a bit gutted to lose that last fish. I really wish I could have stayed there a bit longer. I wish I could have stayed there all day, but there are other things I must do with my day today. But we got into a few fish in the short space of time we were there, which was good. And we also lost a couple, but that's just fishing. Thanks a lot for watching. If you guys have any comments, suggestions, questions or anything like that, just drop it in the comment section below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Really appreciate you guys watching. Thanks a lot. Cheers.